Hey guys, I'm Anika. And I'm Dan. And we're here to give you some tips about what to do on board a Royal Caribbean ship. Every ship has a different adventure. Some of the ships have flow rider. You know how much I love surfing, right? Or maybe skydiving at ripcord by iFly. There's even a zip line. Can you believe you can zip line at sea? Or check out the rock climbing wall. For more activities on board, you have the ultimate abyss, such a cool 10 story slide, or the perfect storm, which is a bunch of water slides. You know I'll be riding that perfect storm all day. If you're kids, they're gonna love H2O Zone. If you love sports, maybe you want to play some basketball or mini golf. Don't forget the Cplex. This has roller skating, bumper cars, and even a circus school. There's also the ice skating rink, or if that doesn't tickle your fancy, you can take a dance class. Let's look at some of the entertainment and leisure on board. One of my favorite things to do as soon as I get on the ship is to chill out on the deck by the pool. Also relaxing on the cantilevered whirlpool. It is a whirlpool that actually hangs off the side of the ship. So you have these views all over the ocean and the side of the ships. It's amazing. Also relaxing in the solarium as well. Great place, there's no kids up there, so I've spent many a night just chilling out in the solarium. Love that solarium. You can't forget about the duty-free shopping though. Absolutely love the shopping on board. I could see you down there all day <laughs> shopping, but actually once you've done duty-free shopping, you can actually do some wine tasting as well, which is a great way to relax. Or you can test your luck at the casino. You love that, right? I'll be down at the casino for sure. An outdoor theatre called the Aqua Theatre is absolutely amazing. The first time I saw that, it absolutely blew my mind. There's high divers diving straight down to the pool, aerialists, synchronised swimmers. It is something truly to be seen. Or you can check out one of the shows at 270. They have six Robo screens and the whole back of the ship turns into a 270 degree screen. That is mind blowing, that screen. It is so huge. Also, the North Star. Have you been on the North Star? I've been on it, it's incredible. It's actually a glass globe that you climb into and it actually goes up over the ship and hangs off the side of the ship. It is so amazing, 300 feet up. To get a photo up there over the whole ship is mind blowing. You definitely need to get up there. Royal Caribbean does have some amazing restaurants, which means I definitely do indulge. It's a good thing they've got an incredible gym where I can work it all off. They also have a yoga studio and aerobics classes. But after a hard workout, I do love to head to the spa to pamper myself. They have facial treatments, teeth whitening, body wraps, and scrubs. It's great for men and women, and it's just one of my favorite things to do. Well, you're gonna definitely see me up there getting a massage, right? Yeah. But did you know that Royal Caribbean International has one of the largest private art collections in the entire world? Yeah, but did you know that Harmony of the Seas has more works of art than the Louvre has paintings? Get out! Okay, for all the families out there, there are a ton of things to do. Splash Away Bay, the kids are gonna love this area. This is a kid's water park. Or maybe you wanna take them down to the carousel. This carousel has hand-carved animals. The kids are gonna love to ride this. If you have teenagers, there are a bunch of dedicated teen lounges for them to hang out in. Adventure Ocean is great for the little ones, which has lots of activities for the kids. Every ship is a different adventure, so to see specifically what each ship has to offer, visit royalcaribbean.com.